All right, our first angler coming out of the state of Missouri, Jay Beffa. Jay's bringing us three today on the boater side. Jay looking for five pounds, 11 ounces to take over first place on your state team. Seven pounds, 12 for the lead. Five pounds, 10 ounces. Just a little bit short today, Jay. Grab you a quick picture. Jay had a good week. Third place overall currently. Jay, pretty good week this week and sitting in third place. We'll see, you know, how far down the standings that's going to hold or, or maybe drop a little bit. But, man, good week this week. I'm sure I'll drop a little bit. You know, it was a neat week um, here on the Arkansas River. It was my first trip here and uh, really interesting fishery. I was actually surprised. I seen the BFLs earlier that had 19 pounds to win it, so that kind of got me excited to come here. And I just didn't cross uh, pass with any of them. Um, I did have a couple good ones. I had a four and a half yesterday. I caught everything mostly on a um, angler's uh, asset spinner bait and a crocky gator flipping bait. So um, I had a pretty good week. Um, just happy to represent Missouri. Well, Jay, we sure do appreciate having you on this stage and look forward to seeing you again. I know you'll be back. Our next angler. Colton Hudson out of Oklahoma. Twelve six yesterday, currently sitting in third place. First place on your state team on the non boater side. Looking for one pound four ounces to take over the hot seat. No problem. Four pounds nine ounces right there. Four pounds nine ounces all the way up to first place on the non boater side. Colton also is sitting in first place on his state team. Colton, come uh, load this hot seat right here. Where are you going? Still early in the way in, Colton, but a pretty good week so far. You want to tell us how you caught him this week? Spinner bait, basically, pretty much all of them. I flipped up two, uh, one rolled on a buzz bait, and I flipped back in and caught it. And besides that, spinner bait. Well, that's good, man. That's good. Good week. Good week this week. I see you got got a little one with you, and uh, I believe the rest of your family's here as well. Yeah, yeah. I want to thank my wife, Brooke. She's been at home with a sick baby. She, the baby was throwing up all week, and she took care of it while I was out here doing what I love. So, well, that's what it's all about. Let's see how long you can stay there, Colton. Currently sitting in first place on the non butter side with 16 pounds, 15 ounces. Coming up next, Andy Gill out of Kansas. Bringing us two fish today on the non butter side. Andy shaking his head. A little bit tougher day. Total weight 23.4 right now. Let's see how much these two's going to add to that. Four pounds, six ounces for you, Andy. All the way up to first place on the butter side. And he's going to get him a quick picture. First place on the butter side, 27 pounds, 10 ounces, Andy Gill. Andy, good week, good week. Sitting in first place right now. Don't know how long that's going to hold out. But, hey, you're also first on your state team. So a little bit, little bit to hang around and wait for, it looks like. Yeah, that was my goal. That was my goal, to win the state. I tell you what, I really enjoyed Muskogee's hospitality. It's been a great week. Um, fishing was was pretty good. We were targeting targeting post spawn fish on rocks and wood wood on rocks basically, but they just didn't bite good today. Hey, one of those days, but man, take over that hot seat. Sitting in first place currently on the boater side. Sitting in first place currently on the boater side. Let's bring up the next angler. Chris Bosley out of New Mexico. Chris. Chris is a regular here on this stage. 17-7 for the coming into this. Three fish today. Five pounds, ten ounces, all the way up to seventh place currently. But he did take over first place on his state team.
Thank you, Chris. Hey, not your first, not your first rodeo this week here on the Bass Nation stage, but, uh, another good, good event for you. And, uh, you know, seventh place currently, first place on your state team. We'll see how long that holds. Yeah, it was, uh, started off to be a great week, but I needed the bright skies. Those fish the first day were all pre-spawn females back in a creek staged and they were, they were stuck to the wood. Uh, there were still fish in there yesterday with the rain and everything. I just couldn't find them. They were scattered. The, the two short fish I caught were in between cover. Never could locate them, so I scrapped that and started, started covering water. And same thing today. Just went and covered water and just couldn't find any big bites. So Yeah, just, just never, never could relocate that group of fish. But good to see you, Chris. Thank you. Next up, Byron Albrecht from Texas, bringing us three today, sitting in 11th place currently, first place on your state team, so let's see how much weight we can get you padded for that right here. Three fish today, 17-3 coming into it, seven pounds, five ounces all the way up to third place, third place and first place on his state team for Byron Next up, Joby V from Arkansas bringing us three fish on the non-boater side. Joby, nine seven coming into this, three to get three today. Needs seven pounds, nine ounces to take over the non-boater lead. Five pounds, twelve ounces, all the way up to second place. Second place overall, first place on his state team. First place on his state team. Good day for Joby. Moving right along. Bringing up our next angler out of New Mexico. Cole Busser. Cole bringing us three fish today. Cole looking for five pounds, 11 ounces to take over the non-boater lead. No problem for Cole. Six pounds, five ounces, all the way up to first place on the non-boater side. 17 pounds, 10 ounces, three-day total weight. First place on the non-butter side, first place on your state team, Cole. Really good week for you. Let's see uh, just how long it'll hold, but, man, a good week any way you shake it right here. Yeah, it was tough that first day. I needed that third keeper, but... I don't know. I had to. I had good boaters all week, but uh, yesterday and today we just seemed to get on the fish. Today was a tough bite. I think that rain kind of messed them up, but we managed to put three in cold once. So I don't know if it'll hold, but we'll see. Well, still early in the weigh-in, but go ahead and load that hot seat. We say goodbye to Colton and thank you. Next up, Tyler Ramsey out of Oklahoma, bringing us five fish today. Looks like a pretty good bag for Tyler. 23-2 coming into it. Looking for four pounds, nine ounces to take over the lead on the boater side. Looking for four, nine. 11 pounds, 12 ounces. 11 pounds, 12 ounces. Three-day total weight, 34 pounds, 14 ounces. Tyler jumps all the way into first place. Tyler, come here and talk for a minute, man. Come here and talk for a minute. Hey, trying to get away. I mean, I know you want to load that hot seat, man. Early in the weigh-in, but, man, a really good bag today. Very consistent three days for you, it seemed like. You improved a little bit each day. Um, first place on your state team and first place overall. How are you feeling right now? Feeling pretty good. I was glad I was able to stay consistent all week. So um, it was a little bit tougher bite. We had a little tougher time today, but we we kind of rallied there at the end and got him, got him in the bag. 
Got them in the bag, man. Lois Highway, let's see how long it'll hold out. Go ahead and load that hot seat. Again, Tyler Ramsey, 34 pounds, 14 ounces, sitting in first place on the boater side. Next up on the non-boater side, Parker Welch. Parker brought us a big bag yesterday, sitting at 11 pounds, 9 ounces. One today, Parker, a little bit tougher day it looks like. Still sitting in first place, though, so it's on your state team. So let's see, 1 pound, 10 ounces to add to that. Fifth place overall, first place on your state team. First place on your state team. Good week for you, Parker. Good week for you. Yeah, Hurts getting locked out the first day, but there's nothing you can do about it. And I'm really looking forward to going and fishing the college circuit next year for McKendree University and John Rinder because he is a great coach, and I can already tell haven't even started fishing yet. Oh, man, you're going you're gonna to love it. Good luck next year on the college series, Parker. Again, Parker's still sitting in first place on his state team. Let's see how long that will hold out for him. Coming up next, Nate Caldwell out of Colorado, bringing us two today on the boater side. Two-day total weight, 23-12. Nate sitting in first on your state team, I see. So I see what we can do to pad that a little bit. Four pounds, 11 ounces for you, Nate. Four pounds, 11 ounces. And, uh, again, second place overall. Second place overall. So you're going to come away with, you know, probably a pretty good little paycheck this week. But I think more importantly, punching your ticket, hopefully, to the Bass Nation Championship. Yeah, that's the idea, right? I'm excited. I heard uh, Hartwell got announced. I really like that lake. So that's going to be fun. Nate says it, it will be fun. We'll hope to see you, sir. Se first place on his state team. Second place overall. Two-day total weight, 28-7. Next up, Brock Inmeyer out of Oklahoma. Bringing us five today. Brock has 15-13 total weight. Sitting in 15th place. 14 pounds, 5 ounces, all the way up to second place overall. Second place overall. Man, Brock, good week for you. Second place. It looks like you really improved, you know, on the dollar dollars this week, jumping all the way up into second. Um, looks like you're going to be a little short of Bass Nation, but man, a, a, a perpetual contender here at the uh, Central Regional. Look forward to seeing you again. Yeah, absolutely. Anytime you get to stay in your home state and fish and stay at home at night, it's uh, it's nice. I appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys coming, and uh, we'll see you next time. Oh, yeah, we'll see you next time. And with that, Tyler Ramsey just punched his ticket to the Bass Nation Championship for the state of Oklahoma. Next up, James Seymour from Texas. Texas co-angler here bringing us three fish today. Looks like three good ones. All right, watch out. Looking for 9-4 to take the lead on the co-angler side. 8-7 yesterday. Oh, man, no problem. 11 pounds, one ounce, all the way up to first place on the non-boater side. Looks like James figured him out in a big way. Man, good job, James. Good job, man. Big jump today all the way up to first place. Again, still pretty early in the weigh-in, but but you got to be feeling where, good, pretty good where you're at right now. I'm feeling pretty good. You're feeling pretty good. Thanks to all the anglers we had. Wonderful sportsmanship. Great guys. Thank you to my wife. She's at home being a single mother. And thank you, Jesus Christ. We appreciate it, James. Go ahead, James. Load up that hot seat. And, again, we say goodbye to Cole. Hope to see you again. Cole still sitting in first place on his state team on the non-boater side right now. Next up, Matthew Noble out of Louisiana on the boater side. Bringing us three today, Matthew. 19-15 coming into it. First place on your state team. Eight pounds, eight ounces, all the way up into fourth place. All the way up into fourth place currently. Two day, three day total weight, 28 pounds and seven ounces. Matt, 
good week for you, good week. Fourth place overall, so you're going to go away, come, probably come away with a good little check. And, again, first place on your state team. And uh, we'll see how long it holds out. But hopefully at the end of the day, you'll still be standing tall. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to have enough. They got some boys, got some. But uh, I just want to say hey to my fiance and my two kids, Emery and Caden. We had a long week, 120 miles a day, a lock. Everything went right except we didn't catch quite enough, I don't think. Well, we'll see how it shakes out. Thank you for fishing with us, Matt. We appreciate you. Matt Noble, fourth place currently, 28 pounds and 7 ounces. Coming up next, Kyle Klein out of Kansas. Kansas non-boater here. Kyle, you need 2 pounds, 12 ounces for first place on your state team. Looking for 2 pounds, 12 ounces. Six pounds, eight ounces. Kyle jumps in to the lead on his state team. Third place overall on the non-boater side. Kyle Klein. Three-day total weight, 17 pounds even. Not, not going to take over the hot seat sitting in third place. Good week for you, but, hey, I think you're right where you want to be as far as punching your ticket to BNC. We'll see how long it holds. I believe you got one more guy to watch out for from the state of Kansas on the non-boater side. Yes, sir. Yep, I appreciate everybody's help, and we've been we've had a great time. And I want to say uh, hi to my wife. She's been at home taking care of a one-month-old and an eight-year-old, so have got to hand it to her. She's helped out a lot this week. That makes it nice when you can come out here and fish and not have to worry about anything back home, doesn't it? Yes, sir. It does. Well, good to see you, Kyle. Hopefully that will hold out for you. First place on his state team of Kansas. Next up, Matthew Abeda out of New Mexico. Matthew, good to see you. 20 pounds, 9 ounces coming into the day. Looking for 2-9 to take over his state team lead. 2-9. No problem. Six pounds, 13 ounces. Matthew jumps up to first place on his state team. Sixth place overall, first on the New Mexico state team. Three-day total weight, 27 pounds, six ounces. Matt, good to see you again. Good to see you again. Another pretty good tournament, and right now... With two to go, you're sitting pretty. Man, I'm excited. Um, pretty tough fishing today. I had like probably eight to ten bites. They were just real finicky. We went down like 120 miles like that other guy was saying, you know, for three days straight. So it was worth it. I want to thank um, my Lord Jesus Christ, my wife, for putting up. You know, with all the fishing that I've been doing the last couple of months, it's probably another couple of weeks before I slow down. So um, I'm off for birthday weekend, so looking forward to that. That's like my first break in, in two months. So, um, yeah, it's going to be um, a good drive home, hopefully, if I can get through the next two. Yeah. Well, let's find out. Thank you, Matt. We appreciate you. Next up. Joe Conway out of Colorado. Joe, one fish today. One pound, five ounces. Got you sitting in 22nd place on the boater side. But, man, a good week for you. Made it to the final day. Yeah, yeah, it was. Um, you know, we all, I think a lot of guys had opportunities that we blew. And it's somebody else's time, that's all. Uh Hospitality here in Muskogee, awesome to us fishermen. Even uh, they were even nicer than the Mexico guys. It's it's really awesome. <laughs> well, that's pretty awesome when you put it that way, Joe. Thank you, and we look forward to seeing you again. All right. Next up, I know there's going to be a roar for this guy, Chris Johnson. Fourteen pounds, fifteen ounces coming into the day. Bringing us four today, Chris. Nine pounds, ten ounces, all the way up into eighth place currently for Team Kansas. 
Eighth place overall. Eighth place overall. 24-9. Chris, another good week for you. I see you're wearing the old patch, patch vest here. Yeah, you know, I'm kind of an old school guy, retro, you know, so, uh, uh, it just makes me happy. Oh yeah, well, it looks good too, man. Well, thank you. You know, it's been a great week. Great to be here again at this uh, last day of a regional like this. I uh, can't thank Bass enough for giving guys like myself this opportunity to uh, reach this level of competition. Got a shout out to my wife, Lucy, there. We always get to spend this week together, so it's been a blast hanging out here. Uh, thanks to everybody at home that's been rooting and texting and everything else. I can't thank everybody enough. It makes my day. Well, man, Chris, we sure do appreciate you. Thank you. <laughs> Next up. Grayson Morrow out of Texas on the boater side bringing us two fish today. Two fish today. Two fish today for Grayson. Let's see how far up the standings we can get him. Five pounds even all the way up to 14th place. 14th place. Thank you, Grayson. And with that, Byron Albrecht just punched his ticket to the Bass Nation Championship for Texas. Next up, Lanny Dooley out of Arkansas on the non-boater side. Lanny bringing us three bass today. Looking for 7-7 seven, seven to take over first place on his state team. 7-7. Seven, seven. Eight pounds even. All the way up to fifth place on the non-boater side. First place on his state team. Fifth place overall for Lanny. 15 pounds, 9 ounces, 3-day total right there. And first place on his state team of Arkansas. Good week for you this week, Lanny. Looks like you got one more guy to dodge a bullet from. You know, the old saying is you can't win it on the first day, but you can lose it, and I'm afraid that's what's going to happen because I zeroed the first day. So uh, other than that, I want to thank my family and friends back home, uh, Mr. Ron Plate, Arkansas Bass Nation president for everything he does and all the other officers that are here, and I want to thank Bass for what you all do. Well, Lanny, we sure do appreciate you, and we sh and I'll echo that. We sure can't thank our state presidents enough for all that they do for their states. We sure do appreciate it here at Bass. Next up, Gabriel Rivera out of New Mexico on the boater side. Gabe, good to see you. 14 pounds, 12 ounces coming into today. Just two for us today. Three pounds, seven ounces on those two. Man, tough day, but man, a good week for you. You made it to the final day of a, of a regional. Yes, sir. Yeah, I appreciate you guys. Appreciate everybody back home, my wife and everybody else, all Team Plowboy and everybody else watching me. Mr. Joe Weber, what's up? Well, Gabriel, we sure do appreciate it and hope to see you again next year. 18 pounds, 3 ounce total for Gabriel. Next up, Trey Huddleston out of Arkansas. Trey brought us a big bag yesterday. Two fish today. Two fish today for Trey. 16th place currently. This is going to move you up a little bit. Five pounds even. 13th place. 21-13. Three-day total for you, Trey. But I believe the lock might have gotten you on, on day one. Yeah, it sure did. I had, I think, 13 nines when I brought up and weighed. And um, went back yesterday and had a really good day. And went was going back today. And, I mean, Blake's got it pretty well covered as far as boater side on arkansas and probably the whole tournament but i was like i'm gonna go see what lives in this place and i went back and i got under the second bridge after i'd already locked down low oil pressure i said okay well i checked the oil last night so i know there's some in there i, I didn't feel like i could run all the way down there uh, and try it again and get back so we locked back up and spent the day right here close and try to salvage something so that's all we could do well, man, I know you'll be back. It sounds like it might have been one of those tournaments, but, hey, your time's coming, Trey. We sure do appreciate you fishing with us. 
13th place, 21 pounds, 13 ounces for Trey. Next up, Travis Bodine. Out of Louisiana, one fish today for us, Travis. If it's a good one, 4-3, you'll jump up at the first place on your state team. One pound, nine ounces. Got you sitting in 12th place currently, Travis. But, man, another good week. Good week, 12th place. Maybe you can walk away with a little pocket change and uh, made the final day of the Central Regional. Yeah, no, I'm happy to be here. I drew uh, three great boaters. I mean, we had awesome days. I learned a ton. And uh, shout out to my wife and two boys back home ready to see y'all. Well, man, Travis, we sure do appreciate it. Safe travels getting home, man. Bringing up the next angler. Keep this thing rolling. Clayton Smith out of Texas on the non-boater side. Clayton Smith out of Texas. Bringing us two bass today. Three pounds, eight ounces for Clayton on the non-boater side. Three-day total weight, nine pounds and two ounces. Clayton's going to grab me a quick picture of those. And with that, James Seymour just punched his ticket out of Texas, and he's currently leading the non-boater side, but he just punched his ticket to the Bass Nation Championship. Let's give James a big round of applause. <laughs> Next up, Jesse Jordan coming out of Kansas. Jesse's on the boater side. Need a pretty good bag to take over the lead. Two pounds, nine ounces for you this week, Jesse. But, man, hey, can't complain. Final day, final day of Bass Nation Central Regional, and, uh, hey, another another regional down. Yep, I uh, had a lot of mistakes, and, you know, I really appreciate, you know, the Kansas Bass Nation giving us the opportunity to come out and do this, and I can't wait till next year. Well, Jesse, we sure do appreciate it. Thank you. Next up, Jamie Lesh. He's no stranger to this stage. Four fish for us today. They need to go 12 pounds even to jump up to first place on his state team. Eight pounds, 10 ounces for you, Jamie. Eight pounds, 10 ounces. Going to get a quick picture with a couple of those. Another good week for you, Jamie. And uh, another, another final day. Come up a little short this week, but, hey, you're going to probably go home with a little bit of change in your pocket and uh, ride back to Louisiana. Yeah, it's been a pretty good week. I mean, I executed great. Um, all you can ask for is to be in contention in one of these things. And when you're fishing against Louisiana guys, I mean, you, you cannot slip at all. And um, I couldn't manage to catch a limit any of the three days. Um, I thought I was on a little more than I really was, but um, – I mean, it is what it is. I do have to give a shout out to, uh, Kent and Travis, the lock masters and lock 17. They worked with us all three days, uh, kept us updated, just great guys. Um, it really helped, you know, getting back and forth, but, um, it's nice to be here. I want to thank Bass for, for hosting this and, uh, or having this and Muskogee for hosting it and, um, just looking forward to getting home and seeing my family. Well, Jamie, man, we sure do appreciate you. Good to see you. And we do sure to appreciate those lock masters for working with our guys all week. Thank you, guys. Kevin Sullivan out of Oklahoma on the non-boater side. Kevin looking for, Kevin bringing us three, looking for eight pounds, 11 ounces to take over the state team lead. Seven pounds, 12 ounces for Kevin. Jumped him all the way up to fifth place on the non-boater side. Fifth place on the non-boater side. Three-day total weight, 16 pounds and one ounce. Next up, out of Louisiana, bringing us five fish today, Howard Hartley. 
Howard bringing his five. Looking for 11 pounds, 14 ounces to take over the state team lead. 11 pounds, 8 ounces for Howard. All the way up to fifth place. Man. All, all I can say is uh, congratulations, Matt Noble. Uh, he did a heck of a job today, managed some fish. Uh, he, I saw him throw back a, a line squeaker today, just uh, in the locks. And uh, and what I told him, I didn't, I didn't want to take it through a technicality, and he was able to pull it out and, and get his first trip to the national championship. So congratulations, Matt. Jamie Lay, same thing. Also, I want to uh, say thank you to uh, the city of Muskogee, Oklahoma. We had a great, great event here. Enjoyed it. People were great. Food was great. Also to Kevin Gobert, our, our Louisiana president. Without him, we wouldn't all be here. And also to my wife and my daughters at home, uh, thank you for allowing me to get here because my daughter had emergency surgery Monday, and she told me to stay. And uh, I couldn't thank her enough, you know, so appreciate it. Well, man, Howard, we sure do appreciate you and safe travels going home. And as Howard just alluded to, Matthew Noble just punched his ticket to the Bass Nation Championship. Next up, Jason Campbell out of Louisiana bringing us two fish today. On the non-boater side, Jason. Three pounds, 13 ounces, all the way up to fifth place overall. And Jason, with that, you just punched your ticket to the Bass Nation Championship. What about that, man? Fifth place overall. And looks like you're heading to the Bass Nation Championship. Yeah, that's uh, pretty great. Uh, I had a few chances at it the last couple of years, couldn't get it done. So I'm excited. I'm ready to go. Congratulations, Matt. I want to thank Howard Hartley, uh, my my running buddy. He's a good. Uh, he's taught me a lot over the last couple of years, and uh, yeah, that's about it. Well, man, congratulations, Jason. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. Team Louisiana. Next up, out of Arkansas, and your final non-boater for the day, Jeremiah Pru. All right, come here, James. It's coming down to James or Jeremiah for the non-boater champion at the TNT Fireworks. Bass Nation Central Regional. Jeremiah looking for two pounds. Jeremiah needs six pounds even to take over the lead. Three pounds, three ounces. And your champion, James Seymour. James, go ahead and grab up that non-boater plaque. We want to thank Jeremiah. Great week. Jumped up to first place on his state team. Jumped up into first place. But your non-butter champion, the 2023 TNT Fireworks Bass Nation Central Regional, James Seymour. All right, and these next two. These next two, Cole Finley on the boater side. Cole coming up, bringing us five fish today. Five fish, two-day total weight, 24-5. What do I got to have? Got to have 10 pounds, 10 ounces. It's Says it's going to be tight. 11 pounds, 15 ounces all the way into first place for Cole.
Cole, come talk to me for a minute. Just took the lead, first place on the boater side, first place on your state team. And uh, let's see, I don't believe you got anybody behind you on your team Missouri. So it looks like you just punched your ticket back to Bass Nation Championship. Listen, a lot of things have to go right to get here, and it's happened all week for me. Uh, a bunch of guys got stuck in the lock the first day. I made it back with four minutes to spare, no penalties. Uh, yesterday, my fifth keeper was a good one. Boat flipped it, and it came off. The hook was still in the bait. It was holding on to the bait so tight that it came all the way in the boat and got in the boat. So, I mean, there's just been a few things happen for me. So, Well, man, that's one of those weeks. Go ahead and take over that hot seat, Cole. And we're going to bring up Blake real quick. Talk to him for a minute. Blake. Blake was the day two leader. Blake Wilson out of Arkansas. Uh, and, man, good week, however this shakes out. But uh, bringing us four today. So uh, four today. Looking for nine pounds, 15 ounces. So it's probably going to be pretty close. But, man, great week for you. Sitting in first place on your state team. So you know you're going to BNC, um, you know. Not much more you can ask for, really. No, it's been a good week, except for today. I actually started off, caught two fish before I locked, and thought, man, these are bonus fish here. It's going to be a good day. And I guess, uh, you know, with the with the fourth one there, or, or having four, one of them got beat up all day. So didn't quite make it. So we'll see what it weighs. I think uh, I don't think it's going to be 915. Size kind of diminished. Uh, I know there's a, there was a boat in there today that they, they stroked them pretty good. Uh, it's just one of those days where you think it's going to be good, and it turns out to be uh, a pretty brutal day. Uh, watching guys catch them, and no matter what I threw, couldn't catch it. So just one of those days. Well, let's go get it and find out, Blake, and we'll sure to appreciate you. Cole, go ahead and step up here. Blake's going to bring his fish, and one of these two guys is going to be walking home the champion Blake looking for nine pounds fifteen ounces eight seven pounds eight ounces and your twenty twenty three TNT fireworks bass nation central regional champion Cole Finley Got it done, got it done in a big way this week. Not only are you heading to BNC, but you just won the 2023 TNT Fireworks Central Regional. Pretty awesome. I mean, I'm telling you, a lot of things have to happen. I mean, I've had a, a bunch of good, it's been a great time. I mean, my team's all been great. All my co-anglers have been as good as I could ever ask for. I mean, they literally let me have everything I wanted, didn't rush me at all. I mean, it has just been a perfect week, so... Well, when you have a perfect week, magic happens, and it looks like it just happened for Cole Finley. One more time for him. Cole Finley, your boater champion. Thank you, Cole. And we got some plaques to hand out, so everybody hang around. But on behalf of Bassmaster, we want to thank the city... The Visit Muskogee Chamber of Commerce, Three Forks Harbor, everything, an amazing week this week for us. As we wrap up, weigh in, and as always, we want to thank Toyota Progressive, Bass Pro Shops, Dakota Lithium, Humminbird, Mercury, Mincota, Nitro Boats, Power Pole, Ranger, Rapala, Skeeter, Yamaha, AFCO, Daiwa, Garmin, Luz, Marathon, Triton Boats, and VMC. Thank you guys for coming out, and we appreciate all our watchers and listeners, viewers back home on Bassmaster.com. For you guys that are here, we'll give out the state boater and non-boater champion plaques here in just a minute.
Hey, Cole. All right. We're going to do each person that punched their ticket to BNC gets the state champion plaque for that state. We're going to start out with Arkansas. The Arkansas non-boater champion for the Central Division, Jeremiah Prue, with a three-day total weight, 16 pounds and 8 ounces. Great job, Jeremiah. There you go. Jeremiah punched his ticket to BNC. The boater on Team Arkansas, Blake Wilson. Blake, great week this week. Blake had a great week with a three-day total of 33 pounds and 14 ounces. Next up. Colorado. Colorado's non-boater, Marshall Allen. Marshall just punched his ticket to the Bass Nation National Championship. Congratulations, Marshall. Thank you. And on the boater side for Colorado, Nate Caldwell. Thank you. Nate Caldwell headed to the Bass Nation Championship. Lake Hartwell, South Carolina. Back home for me. Back home for me, back to Anderson, South Carolina. Next up, Kansas on the non-boater side, Kyle Klein. Kyle Klein headed to the Bass Nation Championship, Kyle. Three-day total weight on the non-boater side, 17 pounds even. And on the boater side for Kansas, Andy Gill. Andy Gill. Three-day total weight, 27 pounds and 10 ounces. Congratulations, Andy. Go grab you a quick picture there. Next up, Louisiana. And again, I want to thank Kevin Gobert for being my waymaster all week. That is such a huge help for me. On the non-butter side, headed to the Bass Nation Championship, Jason Campbell. Jason's three-day total weight, 16 pounds and 10 ounces. Thank you, Jason. And on the butter side for Louisiana. Matthew Noble, Matt Noble, three-day total weight, 28 pounds and 7 ounces. No, man, appreciate you, Matt. Hey, grab a quick picture, Matt. Team Missouri. Team Missouri's non-boater, Joe Whelan. Joe punching his ticket to Bass Nation Championship. Congratulations, Joe, right over there on that X. Step all the way out. And the Missouri State Team Champion on the boater side is also your tournament champion, Cole Finley. Congratulations, Cole. Go grab a quick picture of both of them right there. On Team New Mexico, on the non-boater side, Cole Busser. Boozer. 
Man, why'd y'all not correct me all week? Cole just punched his ticket to BNC. Congratulations, Cole. We look forward to seeing you down there. And on, and on the boater's side, Matthew Abeda. Matt, headed back to BNC. Congratulations again. Thanks for all you did. No, appreciate you. Oklahoma non-boater, Colton Hutchinson. Colton didn't even have to leave his home state, and he's headed to the Bass Nation Championship. Oklahoma's non-boater, congratulations, Colton. Appreciate you. And on the boater side for Oklahoma, he finished the tournament in second place overall. Tyler Ramsey. Congratulations, Tyler. Great tournament in your home state. Second place in the tournament. These guys are all going to be hanging out to get their checks today as well. And then there was one. The state of Texas. On the non-boater side. And your tournament champion, James Seymour. James punched his ticket to BNC. Go grab a quick picture there. Also, your tournament leader on the non-boater side, tournament champion. Non-boater champion. And then Byron Albrecht out of Texas. He's been trying to leave all day to get to another tournament, he said. But looks like he had to wait until the very end. Byron punched his ticket to BNC on the boater side for Texas. Congratulations, Byron. Yeah, other side, other side. And with that, let me go get these checks, and then I'll be back if you want to hang around to receive your check. Oh, Emily says they're ready to go. On the non-buttered side. In 16th place, Ronald Dar. Ronald Dar? Ronald, come get your check. Next up, Joe Whelan. Joe Whelan finished in 15th place. Joe, where you at, Joe? Joe, where you at? Here he comes. Thank you, Joe. Appreciate you. In 14th place, Dennis Dustman. Dennis. Dennis. Travis Bodine in, th in uh, 13th place on the non-boater side. Marshall Allen, 12th place on the non-boater side. William Freeney, William Freeney, 11th place on the non-butter side. P 
Parker Welch. Tenth place on the non-boater side. And also taking home Big Bass on the non-boater side. Good job, Parker. Joby V. Finished the tournament in ninth place on the non-boater side out of Arkansas. Joby, good tournament. Good to see you again. Thank you, Joby. Lanny Dooley out of Arkansas. Eighth place on the non-butter side. Thank you. Appreciate you. <laughs> hey, that. Kevin Sullivan, seventh place. Kevin Sullivan. No, you're fine, man. Thank you, Ron. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. No, right here, right here. Kevin Sullivan. Kevin. Thank you. Safe I appreciate it. Jeremiah Pro. Proof. Jeremiah. Finish the tournament in sixth place. I can't, can't do it, yeah. I, I wish I could. Jason Campbell in fifth place on the non boater side. Jason. Taking on some gas money and a trip to BNC to Louisiana. Safe travels, guys. Colton Hudson. Colton. Colton Hudson out of Oklahoma. Thank you, Colton. Next up, Kyle Klein. Out of New Mac, out of, oh my, Kansas. It's hard when you're looking at the jerseys. Thanks, Kyle. Safe travels, man. Next up in second place on the non boater side, Cole Boozer. It took me all week, but I got it right the last time I got to call his name. Thanks, Cole. James Seymour. James running around. Taking on $2,500 on the non-butter side. Congratulations, man. Safe travels. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you can go. Has anybody seen Dennis Dustman? Dennis Dustman? On the boater side. Big bass of the tournament, Jesse Jordan. Thank you, Jesse. Hey, safe travels, man. Appreciate you fishing with us. In 16th place, Tyler Wilson. Tyler. He's on your team? No. I can't. No. You have to give it to him? Or, or, but I would assume he's, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I, if I could, I would, you know. Timothy Huddleston. Timothy, 15th place on the boater side. Thank you, Tim. Safe travels back to Arkansas. Chris Bosley. Bosley. I don't know why I keep doing that. Hey, you got money, I don't care. 200 bucks. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. Hey, Chris, it might have gotten one day of gas. Yeah. <laughs> Jay Beffa. In 13th place on the boater side. Jay, thank you. Byron, Byron Albrecht out of Texas, 12th place on the boater side. I know, shoot, you better go back. Or no, you better take me back. Chris Johnson, 11th place.
Jamie Lesh. Into the tournament in 10th place. Matthew Abeda, ninth place, headed to BNC. Andy Gill, Andy Gill out of Kansas, eighth place on the boater side. Y'all be safe heading home. Howard Hartley, seventh place. Thanks, Howard. Matthew Noble, seventh and sixth place for Louisiana. Nathan Caldwell, Nathan Caldwell on the boater side out of Colorado, fifth place overall. Thanks, Nate. Safe travels. Brock Inmeyer, fourth place. Safe travels. I know y'all ain't got too far. You too, Brock. Hey, let me know if you need anything. Blake Wilson. Blake's loading his boat. Tyler Ramsey. Tournament first place, Cole Finley. He also is taking home $500 from Garmin. Top finishing Garmin user this week. Jeremiah Pro Luke Pro. Thanks, Jeremiah. James, James Seymour, where are you at, James? Well, that's all, folks.